Wait, 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 wait. I forgot to get y'all on the vlog. Oh my god, oh my god, y'all go check them out. I think we got some new vloggers in the town. We got some new vloggers What's in the up? house. He came all the way from Boston, but y'all go check them out. Links below, links below. I card right there. Go get it, go get it. But they just uh, filmed a podcast with us and it was amazing. It was awesome. Brought his wife this time. It was better than last time because you got the you got the wife. It was better because she was the main attraction. <laughs> oh, look at that. Vlogging vlogception, vlogception. vlogception. Yeah, go check them out. We just had a blast. Bye. Thank y'all. We are going to start off our morning together. There's no video. You guys should listen. Oh, it's so But you can always do that in your mind as much as you want to. You can do another one if you want to while we're getting ready. So right? this is an app by Simply Sadie Jane, a oh meditation app that she's created. So we actually met in Utah. Yes. While you're listening with your parents, and depending on what time you're doing this, if you're doing this at nighttime, make sure you lay in your bed. Okay, they had to run out the door to go to Grand Alley Day today. Um, but as Cullen was saying, these little meditations that the kids were doing are from Sadie Jane, who we actually met, not in Utah, I said Utah. We met her in Seattle um, when we were there back in like July, I think it was. I don't know, it seems like yesterday, but apparently it's been a really long time. Met her there and she's really awesome and fabulous. And then um, I follow her on Instagram and saw she created these little meditations and they are amazing. So I kept getting, it's kind of like the sensory swing that I got for Brooks. I kept getting the ad for it, like the sponsored ad. And I was like, oh, I actually like follow her and know her and met her. And um, she has several that are really great for um, adults and I haven't downloaded those yet. I probably should before I even downloaded the kids ones because I need them too. But the kids ones looked really, really great. And with all the stuff going on in our lives lately, I thought it would be great for our kids to try them out and they loved it. This morning was the first morning that we've done them. This is not sponsored or anything. I don't know if she even knows that I downloaded them, <laughs> but um, if y'all wanna check it out, you can check it out. It's actually not an app. It's like a you can uh, get just the downloads or whatever, and then they're on your phone, and so I was just like playing them from my phone. But she has lots of really, really, really great resources. Um, I got a chance to talk to her for a little while when we were in Seattle, and she was talking about how they had two kids, and um, she shared some of her story on her Instagram about how she had gained a bunch of weight and realized, um, came to a realization that she was addicted to some prescription um, drugs. And uh, as she was trying to lose weight, and uh, it was just a very, very, very eye-opening story. And she talked about her struggles with kind of overcoming a lot of her uh, mental stuff that she was dealing with, depression and anxiety, um, just the stress of being a mom and dealing with all the other things that she was dealing with. And so um, it's a very, very moving and touching story that she has to share. And then 
this meditation that she's done is some that she has found that has been truly incredibly helpful for her. They actually have another baby now. They were done after their two girl and their boy and now they have another little boy that's I think about Brooks's age. Y'all don't get any ideas. <laughs> We're still, we still say we're done after the two, so I don't know. But anyways, uh, yeah, y'all go check it out if you want to, but the kids love it, and I'm excited to download the, like, adult ones because I think they'll be awesome for me to do, too. I probably should have done some meditation before I started this project. I started going through this little easel right here. As I told y'all, I'm just kind of, like, slowly making my way through all the piles of random stuff in different places. A lot of stuff that y'all probably don't even see because, you know, it's over in a corner and it looks like the porch is clean. But then this thing, this easel, was full of just all kinds of little stuff. And so I've got it cleaned, it up, cleaned out and I am getting this off right now. If y'all have suggestions for getting off melted crayons... <laughs> I might just take like a razor blade or something to this and it looks so disgusting But it's from all the pollen and stuff out here That's a bag of all the trash that was in there now the kids can actually use this But my main goal today that I have distracted myself from doing by working on this easel is that I'm starting the books stage of the Marie Kondo process So I'm gonna make a video about that for my channel y'all stay tuned start finding all the books in our house I really want to clean out the garage I have high aspirations for the Day that Grand Dolly has the kids. I'm like, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do all the things. Change your <laughs> we are going to touch a truck. Yay! Yay! And there's, there's a monster truck bouncy house. Where are we going, Brooks? Guess what? What? Guess what? Touch a truck. Say touch a truck. Touch a frock. <laughs> We're going to touch a frock. We're headed to this uh, little shindig that and is. And there's a school bus too. A school bus? Yeah. They've got all these cool little, what are they? Garbage trucks, fire trucks, equipment trucks, old school trucks, police cars maybe, bouncy houses, and it's open to the public. All the things. Here we go. Yay. Let's go, let's go. Look who it is. There's pretty princesses. Look at this, they got all the trucks up here. Whoa! <laughs> Straight to the bouncy house. They don't even care about the trucks right now. <laughs> Blowing up, well, up, up, up the house. Well, <laughs> ours is not a monster truck bouncy house. Whoa, it's a monster truck bouncy house, truck. garbage truck driver and uh, police officer driver. Was that a fun event? Yeah, I'm the police officer. <laughs> that was so cool. Y'all got to honk horns and push girl. buttons and police you're a police girl. girl. Yeah. Woo! From 
touching trucks to swimming trunks. Brooks is in this water and it is like ice. It is not hot for the season yet, but they don't even know the difference. We are over here at Granberry's house and Brittany and Sophia are over here. That was the don't tell mom like uh, inspiration. That's the don't tell mom look. When I was going for the for the look, when I was sending all the stuff, graphic design stuff over. But it is a gorgeous day, and we are soaking up the rays. So fun. And he's coming in hot. <laughs> Touchdown, Bama! Good morning. It is Sunday morning. We are. <laughs> we're we're here. We're managing. <laughs> he came up with his all on his own. He had a football and then he said, where's my helmet? And he went in there and found it. Blue 42. <laughs> Spike. Look, you gotta get down. Oh my gosh. Look, you gotta get down like this. Now will get down. And then you say, one, two, three, hey. Oh jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Say hi. Now you throw it to me. Oh, nice throw. You almost took the camera out. Yeah, dude, you're a good football player. Whoa, watch out. Watch where you're throwing that thing now. That's right. You want to hike it to me again? You want me to hike it to you again? Good catch. Good catch. Oh, fumble. Fumble. Ah! Oh, golly, Moses. We need a new camera. Hey, guys, are you there? Oh, my gosh. We're going to do this again. You ready? Catch. Arms out. Ready? Let's go back. Let's go back. No, let's go back. You can catch it way over there. Ready? Whoa, that's a far catch. Ready? Oh my gosh! Touchdown, Bama! That was like a 20 yard pass, for real, dude. Pass, Mercy. Just throw it for right here. Bro, you're gonna kill somebody. <laughs> Whoa!